Hey, you doing okay there? Oh, it looks like you're trying to build an AI system for your factory line. Ah, I might have a solution. I've recently built a VR demo that uses Google Cloud AutoML object detection to detect objects on a conveyor belt all in real time. I've got the whole thing built in VR and it sounds like it's similar to what you're trying to do. Uh, I could show you if you're interested. Cool. Let's jump right in. All right, welcome to our factory floor. You can see we have a conveyor belt and we have items coming down the conveyor belt. These are items we need to recycle properly. So all the glass goes into the red bin and that gets me one point. And then you can see we've got some organic matter here and that goes into the green bin. More points there, that all is good. Oh no, okay. We're starting to get quite a lot more items. What do we do? Well. First, let's collect some training data to build a machine learning model with. So we have a, a camera rig here that's going to take photographs as the items are coming down the conveyor belt. And they're gonna display them here, but they're also gonna save them for us to import into AutoML. So let's go over to AutoML now. Here is the AutoML interface. We've imported the images that we just captured. And inside the interface, we are able to go in and draw the bounding boxes around each item that we want to train a model to detect. So I've predefined the types of items in the UI and I can just go down and draw boxes and it'll give me a drop down list of the different labels for it to learn. This all looks good. We can go out and we can now train a new model. So we click on train new model. And here is where we specify to train an edge model. This is going to allow us to download and deploy our model directly into our assembly line. We can even inspect the way our data is going to be used in terms of test data and training data. And we can even optimize to have a either more accurate model or a faster model. And here's where we decide how much training time to give it. And what's great is if it doesn't need all the time, it will converge early and stop early. So it's going to go off and train all inside the cloud. And as soon as it's finished, it will send you an email. And that's going to allow you to download it as a TensorFlow Lite model. And we can take our model and we can deploy it directly into our factory floor. So we will do that now. And now you can see it running in real time. You can see binding boxes being drawn on the images there, and it is correctly moving the grabber to put the items all into the correct bins. So you can see how we're taking our images and running our model on them all in real time. So that is how we build a machine learning model to run on the edge with AutoML. All right then, what did you think of that? Now it's your turn to give it a try. If you're inspired and you want to learn more, check out the links below by AI Platform and AutoML.